Robert Ian again, and uh, this time another treasure game, and um, this one's Dynamite Hitty. So a fantastic artwork in the game, um, much like Gunstar Heroes, uh, great artwork. Um, similar kind of look, you know, um, sim similar use of colours. Um, I find the people who who created this game, the imagination behind them is fantastic. It's uh, it's a really wacky and you know crazy game. Um, really really fun to play. Um, this one came out in 1994, so quite later on the Mega Drive's life. Um, and again, you know, they've, they've really pushed the Mega Drive uh, to the limits. Uh, treasure, uh, great looking game. Uh, yeah, um, so let's check it on and see what you think. Say jump, play attack, play pencil. Straight away the game starts off uh, pretty crazy. <laughs> So here we go. So straight away you're getting chased. <laughs> you need to run as fast as you can. <laughs> The visuals are fantastic, um, excellent colours. It seems to me even slightly more colourful than um, Good Star Heroes. So basically the premise behind the game as well is that um, uh, you can Head, you can basically take off his head literally and um, get different powers um, to enable him to do different things. This light in the top left corner, that's uh, your health gauge. So if it's green, you're doing fine, and if it's red, uh, you know, you're pretty much about to die. This is what I mean, it's just a crazy zany game. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
the funnest, funnest games to play on Mega Drive, actually. Uh, you'd have a great laugh playing this, because you never really know what's going to happen next. <laughs> scrolling on the background, it's, uh, it's, it's fantastic. So it seems to me there's basically like little uh, kind of mini games as well where you go through different doors and um, you know you've got to do different things. See how many of these guys, uh, these little toy soldiers, uh, you can smash. <laughs> and I've just changed my head, and now I'm hoovering them up. Chaps, um, I think I'm pushing on time, but cracking little game, um, really fun to play. Um, I mean, visually, it's it's one of the best looking on the Mega Drive. Great use of colours, um, cracking, you know, cracking your music. Um, just really, really fun to play. So if you do get a chance to pick it up, I would definitely get it because I think you'll enjoy it. Um, over now, chaps. Mm -hmm.